Hello and welcome back to my let's play on Total War Free Kingdoms with Sima Young on Legendary Difficulty. Where last time we left off, we had declared war on Shao Jun, um, and we had taken the first town off him, and also just defeated in his entire army as well. I think I'm going to recruit someone here now, in one of these two towns, uh, one of these three towns in fact, um, to make sure that if he is raising a new force around here, we can handle it right away. That would be great before I lose anything. I've got a whole bunch of upgrades to do as well though, i got to do that as well as i got to build some buildings here. This is definitely a food province, so I want to build the government support or the land development. This one's cheaper. Can I still recruit someone if I do that? Because then that would be the one I do, yeah. We're going to recruit Zheng Dan in here. I guess Li Han as well, because he's, he's free, in fact. So we'll put you as the commander here. And then we'll recruit Zheng Dan. Okay, he doesn't like Zheng Dan, unfortunately. But this isn't necessarily the next army. Also, he doesn't like either of the two current uh, options of strategists, so that's not great either. We'll recruit him. Uh, I'm not going to recruit any units, but that's okay. And then, yeah, I might have to switch some things around with these guys. Maybe put someone else in here, but that's okay. Uh, items, I don't really want to give you that. That's a cutting horse. We have nothing for you here. You can have a multitude of items. Your expertise is already low, so it's either the spear or that one. I think I'm just going to go for that. Um, armor, I guess that's better. Less armor, but... More stats overall, way more stats in fact. Um, we lose the bonuses, but we over the 12 charge bonus, but we, we gain the uh, speed and melee attack rate back. With that, I wonder if it'd be worth going for something other than that. Expertise gives me free melee evasion, which is something, but I don't know if that's really worth equipping that for, to be honest. Uh, nothing we can do there, and yeah, I'm gonna have to keep this just to make you happy. You're still in 17, but hopefully the lack of purpose will go away from being in an army now next turn. It's actually something I would like, yeah, I need to have a look at that, because I don't actually know how exactly that works. I would assume that that's what it is. I need to have him give him, oh, hey! Give him a uh, purpose. We can actually reach the town, I did not expect that to be possible. But it clearly is. So we'll let us uh, delegate that one. No night battles available yet, although our strategist should level up again soon. 103 men lost, fair enough, our duelist is a bit low, but I think he already was from the last battle, wasn't he? Another random character, great, and we also have lower satisfaction again. Although once again, that could be a bug, I actually don't know. You are terrible, see ya. Oh, and it went away again, so her actually, she was lowering it overall, what the fuck? Like, we must be very close to having low overall satisfaction in that case, but hopefully he should go up next turn and then we'll be okay again. Got a, not a level up, never mind. Uh, and the town here is, yeah, this is definitely going to be um, focused on, let's actually make quite a bit of money here from industry, so that's fine. This one does give me industry income uh, percentage on that one, but I don't think it's really worth going for that, so I'm gonna demolish this and build something else, and I need to upgrade this level three as well, level four as well. All right, so that's done. You can now run back that way next turn, and then we're gonna probably sprint Need to be replenished a little bit, but I might just want to sprint just to be able to, to make sure I get there in time. Um, other than that, we don't have any money to recruit anything. We've got another mission I can do, so let's go ahead and do that. Hire a character. Are you serious? Actually, no, I guess that would be hiring, or hiring a candidate from here, which is okay. I don't want to, I don't want to do that. Um, does it say anything about like bonus or options we get available? Like perhaps vassalizing people, things like that. Can we? We can offer to cooperate. That's like the opposite of what I want, though. Can I make someone my vassal? Because he's already done it, so. You, Sima G. Uh, no available treaties, why not? Uh, we've reached the rank of Grand Prince, but not by an emperor or a faction. Uh, wait. No, I want to vassalize. Must have achieved the position of Grand Prince. Okay, so we can, once we can become Grand Prince, we can do that. I guess Sima Yi has a unique thing that he can already do it because he's just a regular prince, just like me. In fact, it'd be nice to see if anyone else is actually above what I'm at yet, but I very much doubt it. So far, all princes and even a minor prince of Sima Liang. Is that everyone? Two, three, four, five, six, seven, plus me is eight. All right, cool. We know actually, we do know all the princes. All the princesses in the fairy land. Um, and I have nothing else I want to do here. Oh, right, I need to break that trade at some point. 
Kind of sucks because I have trade. No, I don't have trade available. Maybe I can trade with someone else. Um. Wait, no, I don't want to do that. I'm just, just going to negotiate with him the old-fashioned way. Uh, you, Sima G. Where you at? There you are. Yeah, I don't really want to do this because I lose money, obviously. But I do need to make sure I do this before I declare it. Well, yeah, before I declare war on him, which is going to be very soon. So I'm sorry. Does anyone else want to trade with me? Yes. See my year down there. It's going to be a while before I attack him. See my Yan, who is somewhere else entirely. So that'd be a good option as well. Don't even know where this guy is. I should see some white outline somewhere, but. Oh, here you go. Yep, he's down there. And Gu Zhen, I de definitely haven't heard that name before. He is there. Wow, all the way down there. Okay, who, which one makes the most? 324. Okay, that one makes the most. And uh, that makes the most sense to me as well. Well, this one makes even more sense, but yeah, I'll take your trade. Uh, do you need any food? I have here some food. You have some money. I don't want to give him that much to see where the big jumps stop or start. Uh, up until eight food, actually. Well, wow, okay, let's see what we can get for that. Eh, not a lot. I'm going to drop that down to two food or something, see how much I can get from that. Yeah, it's not much of a difference, to be honest, so that seems fine to me. 140, is that okay? Yep, 144, perhaps even. Would you look at that? All right, and of course the trade, so we're going to make some extra money out of this too. Sounds good to me. Yes, I too believe in that. Uh, I also wonder if I should perhaps block or stop my trade with the Jin Empire because I could trade with someone else and make a lot more money than what I'm currently getting from the Jin Empire since we cannot trade our current position. Um, I don't know. I'm not gonna because it's blockaded because they. But this is a trade port, is it not? Oh, it's that one right there, which is owned by Sima Yi. Yeah, I don't think the Jin Empire is ever going to take anything that will allow them, sorry, to trade with me again. Unless they take uh, this city back. But I don't know when that is. Maybe I should just break, break the trade and get some trade with someone else. Uh, Jin Empire, how much would you hate me if I did that? Probably a decent bit. Uh, no more trade. Minus 24, we're currently on zero. It's green, but apparently, oh wow, we're on plus 19, trending towards zero. Treaties with our enemies, strategic threat. I mean, to be fair, you have a lot of enemies, mate. It's not to, it's difficult not to get treaties with your enemies, to be honest. You're at war with most of the SEMA people already. <laughs> I guess I should be happy that I'm not one of those. Um, I don't want to piss them off. Minus 24, you know, it's not the end of the world, but... Um... Wait, no, that doesn't help. Fuck it. I'll leave it for now. I could make more money, but I also don't want to fuck that over. I was thinking that perhaps we'd be able to trade once we border the uh, fishing port, but we already are bordering that. Because that would count as a port as well, right? Oh, but they yeah, they lost their port on this side, which is where the capital is. That's, so this this isn't the problem. They have... Um, yeah, no, that's not the problem. It's, it's this side that's the problem. Well, fuck it. Maybe they'll maybe we'll get it back some point at some point, maybe we won't. It's okay. It's okay. Right, guy's still unhappy, so be it. The minus five for satisfaction is gonna go away at some point too. Fair enough. Well let's say go. Uh invite Shan Yu into our military alliance. Who the fuck is that? This guy down here. I mean, we're getting a pretty fucking large uh, alliance right now. I'm not sure if I'm a huge fan. Sima Wei is incredibly opposed. Sima Chang is opposed somewhat. Sima Ai is not even up to it, up for it, really. He's one of the people in this list now. Wait, is there only... Yeah, there's five of us, right? Okay. Um, I will reject. Sorry, mate. Didn't actually say I was gonna... No. I will reject that one too. Missing string. <laughs> That's got to be a... <laughs> First I thought it was just something he says. Missing string. All right, you, you messed up. You're missing a string there, buddy. But <laughs> I think that legitimately means there's some text missing. <laughs> All right. I might need to report that one too. Um, 
some stuff. People are going to war. Oh, hello. Another lean year. The taxes are set by the Minister of Finance and they must be met. There is no room for error. Yet a second village has come to you telling you they cannot meet their taxes. Your courtiers whisper that you are, were too lenient on the last village and you risked being taken advantage of. Well, yeah, last time I let them off because it was, it was giving me this stuff. I need one more to get there. So might will probably make me firm hand here. Yeah, exec- oh my god. <laughs> I didn't realize there was going to be fucking a story developing over here. Um, make them sell their homes. Holy shit. That goes for wealth. We don't have any any wealth yet, so it'll be a, kind of a waste. We have five mind. Mind is make them sell. Minus one food, but income. That's pretty good. And yeah, I guess we could go for the mind prestige or the research rate, but I don't care too much about that. Might's good. So is this. We're actually going to get spirit next, uh, like level up if we take this one. But if I let them off again, does it really matter now? Um, fuck it. Execute them. Uh, the nobles love that, by the way. It's the same result, actually. <laughs> Either letting them off or executing them somehow results in the same thing. Um, interesting. Uh, make them sell their homes, make them sell land. Yeah, I'm gonna go for execute. See ya. I mean, no mercy, no clemency, not a second time. You're the tax evaders ex executed. See ya. We don't do tax evasion in my plans. Fiery, nice. Shang Feng. Character rank for my big boy champion over here. You are gonna get Earth and Rampart, I guess. I mean, if I gotta. It's not the greatest ability, but yeah, we wanna go around that way anyway. Cool. Um, we built a building and we demolished a building. We are already building a building here, so I cannot build another building there. Um, we were going for food here, right? So land developments. My goodness, that is cheapo. Okay. I could recruit some units, but I'm not really in the need. Like, I don't need to necessarily. I'm going to start running this way down. Sprinting like an absolute mad lad. Oh, there is a path up here as well. I did not consider that, but I think I'll be okay anyway. Um, maybe I do recruit some units. I don't want these boys, actually. Actually, no, I got more buildings to build, don't I? Yeah, I need more money more than anything else. More food or more actual food? <laughs> the other one's fake food, obviously. How much corruption have we got? 4%, even with our minus 5% corruption reduction. Thingy-majig, boy. Um... More food or more money, more problems. Yeah, let's go for that. Eventually that will learn and lean into uh, corruption adjacent provinces. Or did, oh, actually the next one is already adjacent commanderies. Adjacent commanderies. Two people are now unhappy. Can you stop though? Wait, also, yes, yeah, your happiness going up. It is, the lack of purpose is going away. Okay, so it's gonna be go, it's going away by two per turn. So next turn he won't actually be that unhappy anymore. She is unhappy now. You can also easily get fired if you become a problem, which you're turning into right now. So perhaps you are going to get fired pronto. Because we still have her available. Anyway, yeah, I'm going to fire you right now. So I paid 29 bucks for her for a very long time for basically no reason, but it's okay. All right. No money to recruit anything, so we're all bueno on that one. No diplomacy as far as I'm aware. Uh, I mean, yeah, there is, but nothing that I really want to do. What's Cao Huan down here? You're at war with Sima Mao. Do I have any relations to this man? No, he's, that's not him. That's Mao Wen. Um, you're allied to some people that I am... Oh, wait, hold on. Sima Wei. Sima Liang. Wait, oh, Sima Wei. Who's this one then? That's also Sima Wei. They've got the same name? There's two factions called Sima Wei? What? I was going to say. No way. <laughs> uh, wait, that's Song Wei. Did I just misread that entirely? Am I an idiot? I mean... <laughs> no, it does say Sima Wei. What the fuck is going on? Does it? Sima Wei. Yeah, I'm, I'm not 100 sure. There's Song Wei, but that's the same one, isn't it? Same flag. I'm so confused. I think that's another 
bug there or something. There's so many Simas in this game that the game is just so confused, like, fuck it, we'll call all them Sima, whatever. Figure it out. <laughs> Alright. Let's keep trucking along. We're inviting Sima Mao into the Alliance. Once again, it's up to me to say yes or no. They're barely even up for it themselves, nah. He's not in. Every time he asks me to, I'm... It doesn't say, but I'm assuming he gets more and more pissed off of me rejecting. But the other guys will like it more, so. Uh, well, that's not a bad offer at all. See ya. Instead of taking six grand from him over ten turns, why not just take his towns and make six grand from those? Hmm. Pretty good idea. Can I reach that? Oh, that's just unfortunate. Oh, actually, I can't do anything right now anyway. I need to do this first. We got, an, yes, an event happening. I am sincere. Sorry, I'm cunning even, not sincere. I'm the opposite of sincere. We got ourselves a bodyguard. That is a pretty good item right there. Do you want that? Or do you want that? Both of you have a need for it. Plus 10 melee evasion for your own retinue. Oh man, okay, we're going for uh, this one then. That's actually pretty bonkers. Pretty fucking bonkers. Uh, oh, wait, did I just mess up? Yeah, I did. I be, yeah, whatever. Fuck it, dude. I don't care. Um, okay, I've got 7% movement left over, so I can reach it, apparently. Yeah, it didn't look like I could, but that's why I was, like, moving the camera around. It's like, this doesn't look right. Uh, I, oh, it's one of those. Um, uh, uh, I'm gonna make him come out. I'm gonna starve him out for a sec. But yeah, I'll fight that one manually. Manuali. Spend some money, shall we? Uh, we want the town upgrade there, and that's all my money gone, I believe. I do need to remove this at some point, but currently it's just making me 200 bucks per turn, and all I would make in return would be the uh, patrol building, so I'm actually okay with just keeping that around for a, a little bit. For a wee bit. Yeah, this guy's getting happier and happier. Lack of purpose finally going away. Very nice. We are five turns away from both of those. Because I'm, pre I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm still getting one per turn of both of those. Getting one might from this. And I'm getting um, one spirit from this boy. You know, it doesn't say it there. It says it's somewhere, I believe. It's one spirit alignment per turn. Yeah, there you go. What about you? No. I already knew that. I just wanted to check again. Alright, this is now my town. Uh, yeah, it's easily all resolvable when I fight it. I shall fight it manually. It shall be fought and fought it be shall. Yes. Mm hmm. For sure, for sure. You got that right, Puyang. All right, uh, trebuchet, all right, so we want a place where we have a good line of sight, which uh, I think is right here. I believe I set, tend to set up over here. I want to go further back, despite our accuracy being absolutely fucking terrible. I also need to get a second trebuchet in here now that I've got explosive shots. Sooner rather than later, get the extra experience. Can you guys get full HP yet? You've been so weak for so long. Actually, just keep one or two on either side and then we'll charge them in. Uh, actually, we'll have you sit back. I'm gonna have you up front. You can sit back as well. You really mostly for the vision. Now I gotta hope that they are actually coming towards me. They are good. This is one of the more annoying places to attack, though. In this in this way, the strategy still works, but unfortunately, also these are all gonna miss now. Right in between those units. Except my accuracy is so low that it doesn't matter anyway. It didn't hit anywhere near where I wanted to hit. Oh, never mind, that one did. That was a fantastic hit. Um, yeah, the strategy still works for, uh, doing it like this, but the uh, Lumber Camp definitely has one of the lower like chances of actual proper success on this. It just doesn't really um, do too well. I should probably start actually just targeting units or maybe even firing at will, to be honest. You may come back now. 
Come back to us. Crossbow's going to mess these guys up, no problem now. But the archer's going to start firing back in a second. That's why I got the cav, though. As long as we stay out of range of that. Or at least somewhat out of range. So, wow, they're getting wrecked by the archer. But yeah, crossbow's for now. Let's hold off on that. Um, Got to wait before charging into that unit, too. Stop wasting ammo on that one. Fire the next unit, please. Alright, they're just going to sit back. Nah, wait, there's too many range units there, or too many melee units there, let's just let it be. Let it be, let it be. Our general needs our aid. Does he actually, though? We have a solid amount of ammo, it seems. Although we also are just firing slowly, because that's what happens when you've got um, low, low uh, uh, what do you call it, low experience. Although we're on five experience already. Five, five, four, five, uh, three, five, four. Not too shabby. Do that, and then that should be that. Get him out of here. Oh, there was a fleet over here. Yeah, 183 men. We're good, though. Get us out of here. All right. Didn't lose too much there. Hundred and eighteen men. I can live with that. <laughs> Not a random fucking character. I don't think these are so random anymore. Did we get level up? What was that? Yes, we did, and we got an unhappy woman. Oh, because she leveled up, she now wants to have a higher core position. You fucking twat. Night battles, please. Um, you're okay. Yeah, that's you, right? Well, you're gonna have to hold on till we level up, which won't be for a while, I'm afraid. You have to find some other way to keep her happy at some point. Uh, anyway, let's see here. We took the lumber yard. Yeah, that's just oh hello. What the fuck is that? Requires reform. Okay. What the fuck is that? Oh yeah, we got administrator come again, so we could put her in there if we absolutely have to. We also have ourselves a building that can be upgraded. Uh, yeah, might as well. That's the place where I put yeah put a character in there too, so that makes sense. Next turn you're gonna take that, and then you're gonna. I, I could probably even get rid of these guys again, but. I'm gonna keep him around for the moment. How old are you? 50? Ah, oh, you're kind of old. Oh yeah, I forgot all my characters are old. This guy's 52 already. And the other good one is 47. Yeah, that sucks. They're not gonna go all, get all the way through to the end of the campaign. That is pretty unfortunate because characters in this game are so strong. You really don't like, the, well, the difference is so huge. I mean, I should say like this guy having a hundred stats. Sorry, this guy actually only has 70, but still, 70 as opposed to 15 is a pretty big difference, you know. And we're going to lose all three of them around the same time, probably. Unless some of these guys are legendary legendary for getting old, like uh, Huang... What's his name? The guy from uh, Liu Biao. Not him himself, but the other one, the Tiger General or something. Anyway. Unhappy Bloody Blue. Let's keep going. Keep on trucking along, boys. Surprised I haven't really been pulled into any wars yet. Although I suppose if you make an... I'm not sure if you actually... If you declare war on someone yourself, it doesn't necessarily become a military war, does it? Everyone has to vote for it, don't they? Or is that just a... I don't even know. Uh, peace, that's not great actually. I want you guys to keep murdering each other. That'd be great. I'd rather deal with one massive faction later on than like six different smaller ones. Eh, it depends actually. Living in harmony. Who's this? Su Ning Ningping. Uh, not bad actually. And Shen Wen Chin. I'm good. But thank you. Oops, I did not actually even check that. Oopsie. Oopsie Daisy. Uh yeah, probably need to do more, but let's see if I can take this town. They're probably recruiting their units here, I imagine. No. Well that's another all old then. And I can night battle load now, perfect. Perfect. Wow. An uncommon talent, huh? Shi Wei, hello. You're legendary. 
you're not actually, but you are cordial, charismatic, and agile. That's pretty good. You're pretty good, my friend. I will keep you around for now. Uh, yeah, we'll have a look at that in a second. A level three town here, which is probably required to get upgraded horse pastures. I don't even. That doesn't give anything, does it? So we can make this place whatever we want it to be. Don't think I need another food province, so we'll keep it uh, industry income. We'll get rid of that one. Although, if I'm gonna upgrade, yeah, I shouldn't actually do this right now. Okay, so the, yeah, this is a bit of a waste now. Uh, I can either get rid of you guys or keep you around and actually build a new army, but I think, I think she, he's gonna be unhappy if I do this, but... I guess I can just get rid of the units and just... Yeah, because I don't actually want those. The only thing that they'd be useful for is if I replace them, I already have some men. Um, so the unit will be replaced like better, basically, but... Yeah. Um, like, we'll have more men immediately available. Available. But now I'm good. Got a little bit more money left over actually after that, so we can upgrade one of these buildings again. Let's go for the regular food building. The regular, well, actually, let's go this one. And then I can upgrade that one afterwards with while still having the Tufa Lady in here. Tofu Lady. Alright. We're gonna be pretty... Uh, we're gonna be done with this pretty quickly as well, these two guys. So I might need to consider breaking my trade with him as well, so we can start going to war with him right away afterwards. Are you besieging that? Yes, you are. Hmm. Is the Jin Empire like the Han Empire? Like, fucking terrible, basically. No armies. We saw an army of his ages ago over here, sailing. I honestly don't even know how they didn't manage to protect themselves around here. Oh, fuck me, this has been taken by this guy as well now. That must have been really recent, actually. So there must be an army in here or on its way over here now. Good to know. You could even go down there and check it out, I guess. Check it out now. The Fang So brother. Uh, you know what? I can go over there. That's normal fucking movement. Yep, there's a full stack right there. Some Chi Guardsmen. Alright. Good for you, my man. I'm getting back in my safe city, if you don't mind. Got ourselves a level up. Didn't even notice that. Hello. Oh, hello. Definitely want that. What did I do with the other one? Wait, I don't have any other one. Never mind. This is the first one. Um, yeah, this is not as important as that. Both of these are pretty meh. But that, that... We do want most of the stuff up there as well, though. Um, yeah, let's go this way. Avoiding ambush is not too bad either, actually. Actually, avoiding ambush is okay as well. Keep trucking along. Quest for military support against Sima Ying. Who the fuck's that again? Oh, that's him. Right. Uh, nah. I think I'm good. I mean, you could definitely give me some stuff for this at least. How much is that worth to you? You grossly overestimate stuff as well. No, you don't. Wow, that is a gross underestimation. Holy shit, you know what? Why don't I just buy that off of you real quick? <laughs> Completely different deal on the table. Everyone walks away satisfied. Which means you probably also undervalue my items, don't you? No, wow, you actually rate that higher. I don't think I've got any silver item that I don't want, though. But... I don't want to give him any ancillaries. I'd want to buy it. But I think I have to give him too much money for that to be worth it. 450 bucks per turn for 10 turns. That's four and a half grand for that item alone. I don't think so, friend. But that is pretty good. 6.1 for that item. Don't know why it doesn't rate it very highly, actually. Peace of Mao Wen. That's one of our allies. Sima Yan declared war on Sima Jian. <laughs> Your name is too similar to mine. I'll kill you! Uh, Alright, so we've got an extra administrator position now. Good, good. Living in harmony. Fantastic. 
Um, yeah, we'll have a look at that in a minute. We don't have enough building or enough uh, towns yet that I don't have to worry about checking everything specifically every time. Uh, what do we want to do? So yeah, we could actually get wealth alignment over time as well, but I don't know. Man, I don't know. Uh, let's go for construction time agriculture. You know what? Let's let's do that one now. That's a good one to get. We have two buildings to upgrade here in, in agricultural stuff. We got one there. Uh, many here. Yeah, no, because I wasn't going to go food here. I was going to demolish this, was I not? Or, I, no, I was. This one I wasn't going to go. Yes. I was going to demolish this. Uh, no, I was going to demolish this. Yes, I got it. I remember. Uh, so I don't want agricultural buildings there, is the, what I'm trying to say. Uh, so yeah, this one. This sounds good. Let's put you in there and do that. And then everything will go super fast. Great idea. I love it. Right, time to get some extra income from... Oh my god, as a... F well, I guess I could have expected that at this point. Hello. It's actually in his favor, but he will start taking attrition immediately, so he'll likely sally out. That's a pretty big garrison you've got there. Night battle wouldn't really help me. It is an actual... horse. Oh, no, it's a field battle, it's horse pastures. Uh, okay, so if I siege him out, he's probably going to sally out immediately anyway. So I might as well just do the battle right away with a night battle. Now, if it makes me make things go faster... Uh, plus it means that if I win, I don't have to finish everything off. We can just take the time right away because it's a garrison. Yeah, you've got one unit of cav, two units of cav. Three, four, five, six, seven units of cav. That is quite a few units of cav. 24 units of cav on the wall. Take one down. You smash it into some archers. 24 units of calf on the something pasture. Uh, yep, let's do it. Sorry, I was, got a bit distracted there. Just a wee bit distracted. A fire burns in my soul, ceaseless and strong. How true. <laughs> I know that a fire burns in your soul. You were right, sir. It's like such a kiss ass. Fire burns in my soul. Yes, sir, that is true. Definitely, sir. All right, before we do this, give me uh, a single second. I have returned. Do not worry. All right, let's uh, set this one up. Uh, so yeah, they're not gonna have any gear or any reinforcements. It's just gonna be everything together. So I'll set up slightly further back, so my trebuchets have a second to wind up before the enemy arrives. Oh, I sh keep forgetting I need to change uh, one of these crossbows to another trebuchet. Another trebuchet. They have a lot of calves, so i got to go super wide here. And basically a little bit further forward too, and then just go like that. Like that, and then I have this unit. Kind of sit over there. So our middle is going to be a bit weak, but we've got the generals to make up for that, so we should be okay. And our own calf is going to have to hang back as well, unfortunately. All right. General, you're still a bit wounded, but you're mostly okay. Didn't actually check what kind of generals they had, so... I also have turtle formation, but that makes my formation smaller, so I don't know if that if I want to do that. Huh. Huh. Yeah. No, it's not... It's not, still not perfect, but whatever. Suck it. That is a wide fucking formation they've got there. This might be a tougher battle than I expected. Also, I have a trebuchet. I don't know if you've realized this, but... You should come towards me now. All the calves on the right. Well, it gives me a chance to set this unit up over here as well. So I definitely won't have any issue with the calf. And then I'm going to send all of you, eh, three of you, over here. Um, and then the entire formation, minus these three boys, is 
going to be trucking on up a little bit. Did they have a trebuchet too? No. I'm starting to think, like, why are they sitting back? Do they perhaps also have a trebuchet? But nay! They do not. I think I have to go up a little bit further than that, actually. Take this here formation and... Actually, are we in range? We are in range, never mind. But it's going to be shitty shooting though, isn't it? Well, they are coming, so yeah, let's just leave it. Actually, are they? No, they're not. Of course, they have a fucking strategist, so they've got loose formation available as well. John Wick. Duh. All right. I can't follow it any further. My camera is restricted. Okay, we'll do some manual shooting here. Ugh. This unit is just not experienced enough to do anything. Your shit. Oh, okay, that's somehow triggered them to come towards me. What the fuck's up with that? Just firing the massive amount of units around here, and we should be okay. The Mahusif amount of units. Get you guys further on the flank, because there's a lot of shit over there. There's like three units at least. It's crazy. It's a crazy. Oh man, them going into normal formation didn't actually help that much. Uh, Dao infantry captain. I kind of want to look at those because the Dao is a saber. I haven't really seen those yet. Wait, I can't pause it unfortunately because legendary. That looks like a that just looks like a John. I'm sorry, but that is not a Dao. Oh, fuck me. Hello. <laughs> Looking at some units. <sighs> Alright. I'll have you over here just in case they do decide to go all the way around. I very much doubt they will go that far, but still. I should also put you guys more like this. And also, you guys are getting properly chased down, so let's just get you around the, all the way. All the way. Let's make sure you don't charge into me here. Charge into my spear guard, would you? Oh, you certainly would. That's most of the cav. Actually, no, that's like three of the seven units they've got. Ugh, what kind of a poor... Why didn't you die? Why won't you die? Go there. Don't get caught now, huh? Ah, Shane, don't get caught now, huh? Does anyone want to duel you? No, surprisingly not. We'll go kill them manually then, please. Please. Okay, I think we got past them. Keep sprinting, boys. No, no, get in there. I will be hurt. Feels like a waste. And eh, then again, hold on, do it, because that means about the route. Oh, but now I moved out of range, goddammit. Such an idiot. Okay, just charge in there then. You murdered those units, okay, we're breaking most of the count. Oh, hello. Didn't really get to counter it, but I still killed some of them. It's not too bad. I kinda, I'm gonna keep you guys standing there the way you are right now. Just the way you are. Ba -dum, ba -dum, ba -dum. That's just the way it is. Oh, I guess I won't be dueling whoever that was. Things will never be the same. Nice, we reckon them right now. I guess the night bonus of morale loss is uh, working out for me. You know what? No, you're gonna have to stay stationary there. Because we're going to get charged again in a minute. That's just the way it is. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of boys around here. Do you scare people? Is that a thing that you do? Yeah, you do. That's why these units are riding so easily. Are you a scary boy? Why, yes I am. How did you know? Okay, you, yeah, you need to kill them or her. You need to come over here and murder these dudes here. Because I feel like we're pretty close to mass riding them when the generals die. This should have took a bit of a beating and I intercepted them. Intercepted. They're getting wrecked by the crossbows now. Uh, charges have indeed happened, it seems. Keep murdering him, please. This guy's about to rout. Give me a hamstring in there. That's a complete miss now. Oh, enemy unit flees. General's about to rout. Both of them are. That one's about to die. Gone but not forgotten. 
gone. You want to fucking attack me with that? I want to see what happens to you if, uh, if you do that. Okay, this unit's actually still going as well. Keep killing her, please. There's Archer coming back now because my scariness is not close enough anymore. Mm, oh wait, that's not the, what I meant to do. Ah. Alright, can we just kill a general and that will... There we go, that one routed to kill that unit now. You kill that one. That one must be dead close, close to being dead now. It's got 9.6k, never mind, it's nowhere near. Uh, I believe we've won, there we go. And we don't have to kill everything off because it's the end. Although if I don't kill these generals, they might actually just go join some other faction with a grudge against me, so... Let's make sure we kill them off, why won't we? 3.6k. Still 3. Point, oh, okay. Guess we just did 3.6k in a single hit. Or maybe it doesn't update, no, it does update when you hover over it, doesn't it? 2.7k. Oh, and he's dead, yeah. Goodbye. Good stuff. Yeah, yeah, Cav did alright. I can't really complain about that one. That was the one that was dealing with the enemy cavalry, so they're not gonna have many kills. Still did well, though. They seem to destroy cavalry as much as the next guy. Thanks for the town, and thanks for f being dead. As a faction. Hey, it's an uncommon talent. Is it though, or is it just some random dude who's like, hey, can I be a captain? And someone said, yeah, go on then. It's uh, Yu Luan. Direct, stern, and impeccable. <laughs> and then he has minus three noble support. He cancels each, uh, himself out. Kind of a waste of a trait though. Um, nah. I'm good on Vanguard, thanks. Farewell. Oh, oh wait, I do need to do this still. But that was going to be you, because you're a bit unhappy. You don't get any good bonuses. Minus two food production is a bit of a shame. The rest is okay, I guess. I mean, it's fine. Alright, fine. Because you're the least happy person in my faction right now. And you feel, personally, that you deserve a higher rank. You rank, bitch. Ping one. Which one is that? I don't even see it on this list. Am I blind? That's kind of weird. Why didn't I see ping one on that list? Um, okay, one thing you can also do. Oh, wait. Because we already have someone in there. Well, what the fuck then? Well, I'll be damned. Why would you do that to me? Uh, peasantry income, I believe she's buffing. So, I mean, to be fair, every single province we have is going to have peasantry income in it. Uh, this is a livestock farm. Yan Man technically has more, but it also gives uh, straight up income. So fuck it, we'll just take Song Sh Song Shan. Now, no, don't be don't be pissed off with me anymore, all right? I'm actually probably relatively close to high satisfaction, if we're being honest. Well, maybe not high. We're definitely above low, though. Yeah, we got a lot of medium stuff. Nah, we're not we're nowhere near. Fuck that noise. Clear lie. Right. Tongji. You have a grudge against Song Wei, also known as Sima Wei. <laughs> because the game doesn't realize or doesn't understand names. My god, look at her fucking happy face over here. <laughs> Holy shit, she's happy with herself. Uh, I don't want you though. You're not joining me. You're not joining me with that happy face. Hey, and she actually does have a, um, a grudge against Sima Wei. Well, well, well. If it is a bun if if it isn't a bunch of people hating my relative somehow. How is he related to me again, Sima Wei? My dad is Sima Gui. Sima Wei. Fucking loves me. His dad is Sima Yan. I guess I don't know. Cousin maybe? Sima Ying is also a son, so Sima I. Sima Yu is from Sima Tai. That would be Tsai, wouldn't it? Um, then we have Sima Lun and Sima Liang are from Sima Yi himself. He was the youngest son. Fuck me, he's old as well. He's 67 though, it's not not quite as old as his, as his older brother. His older brother! I think that's everyone, except for him. He's from Sima Yu. Sima Mi? No, Sima Yu. 
Uh, I think yeah, you're just one of those brothers. So yeah, I'm just by my lonesome over here. Must be a cousin or something, I don't know. But if it was a cousin, it would be in that list as well, wouldn't it? I'm so confuzzled. Right. Um, I will check next turn when I'm allowed to declare war on them by literally just declaring war on them and see what happens. Hey, it's Sima Yi. <laughs> it's just misspelled. Who, was who did that, I wonder? Um, yeah, we can build something in many places, in fact. Let's just go through it like this. That's well, let's have a look at what else we can do. Foist of all. Uh, right, so we need... Yeah, that reform, which is pretty good though, That once we get this, so that might be one that I should focus on at some point. Speaking of, I need to do something right now, so... I don't care too much about the replenishment of stuff. Character salary is okay. Food production is pretty good. Character experience, I don't really give a fuck about. Building up keeps nice for later on, but... Uh, there was something else here I wanted to get, I believe. Do you believe in life after love? What was it? I didn't even recall. Oh, we got units recruited in a different way as well, like Pearl Dragon's just down there. Seems to be much easier to actually recruit some good units. Some good fucking units. Um, Yeah, I guess I will go for it. No, there was something else I definitely wanted to get. I wanted to go down there, but I, yeah, I'll go this one, another small detour. Because that corruption reduction in all adjacent provinces is going to help out quite a bit, I reckon. Oh, I reckon. Um, what else can we build, though? Sure. Let's get all those basic farm buildings up now. Um, you're still there for one turn. Are you being recalled right now? No, you're still there for one turn. Yes, okay, so in Bohan, yeah, that's here, right. So that was the plan, wasn't it? We built that one thing and then we built that one. Yes, I remember. Oh, I remember. And then on Ping, I have no one. Ping one, do we have someone here? Nope, all right. Well, and I'm focusing on this one first then. Food, please. Yeah, go for that. Go for that. See, so yeah, next turn we declare war on him, and then if I'm not allowed to yet, we'll see how long before I am allowed to declare war on him. I think it might be another one or two turns, honestly. We shall see soon enough. Um, that's three turns away from level four. That one's one turn away from level four. What is our mission again? Oh, you ever hire a character? That's just not, it's not gonna fucking happen though, is it? Do I look like I need any of these losers over here? You're uncomplicated. You're a fucking nobody is what you are. Um, yeah. These people are literally just out there to give them a purpose. <laughs> they don't know that their purpose is essentially useless, but uh, no, I'm going to pass on that one. As I've said many times before, you are one of my future targets. However, I just, said he, I just saw he's rich in both food as well as wealth. So, And I think he's still stronger than I am, so it could be a bit scary. I think we're getting to the point where I could probably start thinking about actually recruiting a proper second army now. Coalition, the, the women coalition. I mean, <laughs> who's scared of those? <laughs> Sorry, joke. It's just a little joke, isn't it? Yeah, an ambush here, apparently. Good for you guys. A farmer. Uh, that's for administered commander. Okay. Got ourselves a farmer there. I remember I need to do that. Uh, yes, building. This was going to be... I mean, it's going to be food, but it's possibly going to be switched over to that one to give me just loads of money. But I don't know if it's worth it. Probably not. I tend to find that it isn't really. Food is so much more useful. Level up on Manhuriri. We're going there, for sure. No doubt about that one. And we can build something here. I guess I'll go for that now. We need the T1 for this. Yeah, I do like this more. <sighs> Save the money. Well, unless I can do the, the war here. Am I allowed to declare war on you just yet? Hey, I'm so sorry about this. I can do an alliance war. Propose a vote. Nah, fuck it. Oh, I'm already allowed to do it. Without becoming untrustworthy. Well, in that case, might have some other things to build. Hello. 
I mean, your land. What are you going to do about it? You want to surrender? No. Wow. Okay. Well, then you're going to die. I mean, it's as simple as that. It's not up to me. It was your choice, man. Oh, yes. An uncommon talent. I wonder if this person's actually uncommon. Hufang. You, my man, are pretty meh, if I'm being honest with you. Goodbye. Actually, you know what? Let me just quickly check. Be very sad if, 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 if this works, but no, nope, they don't like him. Right, you're fired. See you later. You can hoof find the right off. All right. There is an actual army, but it's still not particularly large. Mounted crossbows. Yep, let's get that upgraded. Iron mine. This does not want to be food. Plus, that's the wrong food building altogether. Uh, I'm going to simply downgrade it for now. I could convert it, but that would take a turn from that. So I'm going to get rid of it. So for the moment, let's just downgrade it. So we still make some money from it, at least. A lot less money than if I leave it like this, though. But I don't really want to spend six food. I'd rather actually sell the food or trade territory or whatever. I'd love to buy these couple of territories around here from the Jin Empire at some point. That would be fucking rad. Right, I can still build something. Um, it's pretty high upkeep cost on this. Oh shit, actually, yeah, getting upgraded to level 3 gives me the 30% income from all sources already. That's not bad. Let's go. Okay. Uh, yeah, I think that's it for now. So next turn we attack that right away, I think. Unless I want to replenish a bit. He could technically go down south. Actually, I think he can reach my fishing port, but it's got a pretty decent garrison. I think if he did that, we'd be able to defend it. That should be okay. So I doubt he's going to do that. He might recruit more. Maybe I'll just move up into this forest to sit into informate in, um, whatchamacallit. Also, what I want to do, but I keep forgetting to do, is recruit another trebuchet. Level 1 trebuchet. Great. That's what, the one I, that's, that's what I like to see. Oh shit, we got the level 2 might, I just noticed. We're also quite close to getting to level 2 spirit then, I think. Me thinks. Oh, I've got an extra 10% movement range now. That's pretty baller. Uh, yes. Oh wow, next one gives us minus 5 noble support. That's pretty rough. Wow, we need 100 for the next one. Fucking hell. The next one probably after that, 200 or 250. Probably 200 and 500. So yeah, I guess it does take a lot longer to get to the later ones. Um, the maximum level of this alignment has no negative effects. Oh, interesting. So you get to level 3, it gives something negative. Level 4 gives something probably more negative. And level 5, it uh, removes all the negative shit away again. Interesting. I like that. Shan Yu from the coalition. Wait, wasn't that guy in our alliance at some point? Did he drop out? I never even noticed. <laughs> plus five spear in alignment, plus five wealth alignment. Holy shit. Uh, this makes this guy unhappy. Shi Wei. He's the guy we just recruited, is he not? Why well, is in this random town. So yeah, I think I put him on assignment here. Um, the Ministry of Educa Education has submitted a final review of the nine rank allocations. Upsettingly, one of your retainer clients has received a lower rank than they expected. Your retainer asks that you correct this obvious mistake if they are able. They also offer, of course, to cover any necessary costs. Oh, I get a, I get a thousand bucks from this. I thought I uh, lost a thousand bucks. Um, so yeah, the system is clearly right. This guy just wants to pay his way up the rank, but it's obviously just a minor mission. The horse pastures. Uh, I lose some money, or I gain some corruption here. For five turns. Wealth alignment. I think spirit alignment is more useful. I get an upgrade right now if I get that. But I upgrade that one regardless next turn. So maybe I should start going for wealth. I don't care too much about wealth though. But I don't care too much about spirit. Because once we get to this level, like what's the point? Eh, fine. I'll intervene. I shouldn't decrease my money that much. 30% corruption in this place doesn't even do, not do that much. Chi Huang. Or Chang even. Is a man who is not going to get hired by me. Uh, Hertzman, great. Built a building or two. 
All right. Um, yeah, our army does need to replenish a little bit longer. I think I'm just going to sit in the forest here and ambush them. Or I'm just going to siege them out. It's a little free town, so it's going to start taking attrition immediately, I think. Yeah, maybe I'll just siege them out. Fuck it. Let's see here. I also need to end this episode, I think. So why don't we just do that right here? Thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Next time, we're going to finish off Sima G. Oh man, I should start. Uh, yeah, I should probably get rid of the trade with Sima Loon. Last time we saw his army, it was over here. He's got a whole bunch of land for me to take. This is owned by Sima Loon as well, so that one as well, actually. So yeah, all of that I can take. Pretty good. And if I could buy these two from the Jin Empire at some point as well, that'd be great. So let's uh, stop our trade with you. Uh, which means I should do that next time. Right, yeah, sure. That makes it... Oh, I also need to get rid of all these other things. I need to let that one run out too. So I might as well get rid of it next turn, I guess. Um... Yeah, get rid of all of our deals next turn. We're gonna be we're gonna piss them piss them off so much immediately, but that's okay. If I need to, I can recruit an army here very quickly as well. Anyway, next time. Until then, thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Have a good day and goodbye.